hello everyone uh, welcome to my channel so in this video we will see how we can download the dependencies for the main project to a specific directory on my uh, local machine so there are two ways by which we can do this by using the maven command okay and by using the dependency plugin in the maven project okay so i have created this simple maven project so let's say i need these two dependencies as of now so i need to add these dependencies in the form.xml file of my maven project all right so that we have already seen so once i added the dependencies and i need to save this pom.xml file so once it is saved you will get this memon dependencies folder over here and on the local machine where uh, those will be downloaded in the dot m2 repository that is your local uh, repository on your local machine right so this is the m2 repository and depending upon the group id for that dependency uh, all those jar files for this artifact will be available okay so for instance this has org.selenium.hq then selenium and this has org.testng okay so if you want to find it in the m2 repository go to the org first then here you will find the let's say selenium hq right inside it you will find the selenium so depending upon the uh, artifact now uh, the jar files will be available so artifact id is now selenium api so there will be different versions available uh, for this selenium we have used in the different pom.xml file in the different main project on my machine okay so this is the current one along with .m2 repository i want these dependencies on some different folders on the local machine okay at the project location or any other location okay so how i can do that so first let's see with the help of maven command so here we need to use the mvn so if you are using the command prompt you need to use the mvn keyword here mvn then uh, you need to use the dependency plugin over here so dependency right then colon and you need to provide the different goals so for this plugin there are different goals available for the management of the dependencies so as of now i need to copy the dependencies so i will use this goal copy so let's try to run this command with the help of uh, eclipse id so i will copy only this command i don't require the mvn so go to the project location right click on the project then go to run as and maven build so this is the command i want to run click on run build success so as you can see it has copied all the dependencies in jar files to the uh, workspace then my project then in the target folder and it has created this dependency folder and under that dependency folder all the jar files will be available okay so let's refresh the project okay so if we expand this target here you will find this dependency folder and all the jar files are available in this folder now so if you are using this command mn dependency colon copy dependencies for this by default uh, directory to download the or copy the dependency is target folder at the project location so what if i want to download to a separate location okay so same command just give the space then hyphen d so here i am going to set the property using the d then uh, here you can provide the output directory then equal to then use the dot that means at the current project location in that create the let's say my so it will create this folder my dependencies and under that folder you will find all the jar files okay so by default it is going to download in the target folder instead of that this time it should download in the my dependencies folder at the project location okay so build success and here you can find this it has copied file to this uh, project location and then this folder after you refresh the project you will find this folder is created and under that you will find all the jar files available now okay so this is how you can uh, download the jar files or copy the dependencies to a specific uh, directory in the project location or any other location if you want to download at some other location instead of dot i will use my dependencies or any let's say c drive you want to download or d drive you want to download like that okay so just remember if you use the dependency plugin and copy dependency goal then out, uh, by default output directory for this goal is target folder in the maven project so if you want to change it just use the output directory and provide the directory value over here so now let's see how we can do the same by using the dependency plugin in the form.xml file 
okay so from that XML file we can add the different plugins and different dependencies we need to uh, add for our for running our main project okay so for plugin we need to add the plugins under build tag right so first I will add the build and here we need to add the plugins tag and under plugins we can have the multiple plugins right so let me add the dependency plugin so this is the main dependency plugin information you need to provide in the pom.xml file right so i am using the 3.6.0 version so as you can see it has used previously the by default 2.8 version okay so you can specify different versions for this dependency plugin to use and in that i have provided the executions then execution here i need to provide the package right and the same goal as you have used in the uh, maven command okay copy dependency goal okay so under this configuration you can provide the different configuration required for this plugin okay so as of now let us uh, try to download the dependencies at the default output directory okay so before that I will first clear the Maven project so that this target folder will be clear right so I will click then Maven clean now just show the pom.xml file okay so now if you go to the uh, target folder as we have used the default configuration it should have copied all the dependency or all the jar files under this dependency folder so now if i want to download at the specific location so here you need to use the configuration now so here i will use the output directory okay and in the square bracket i need to provide the value of the directory okay so again i will use the my and just to save this pom.xml file so you can see on the at the left hand side we got this maven dependencies folder created over here okay so i i don't require to use the square brackets so i will uh, remove those and let's save it again okay so now it has created this maven dependencies 2 folder okay so you just need to provide the uh, your folder name in which directory you want the you want to copy the jar files for your dependencies okay so no need to provide in the square bracket so that is all for this session guys uh, please try to share the uh, videos which you find the informative with your friends or with your colleagues uh, who are learning the automation okay so thanks for watching i will uh, see you in the next video soon